what really resonates with the students are examples from real life. Uh, and one way that you can show that is to do demonstrations in class. Oh, that's out. That's out. The concept that I was teaching today is diminishing marginal product. How much does adding one worker do to my product? How much I produce? They had to move a ball from one box to the other. We each had to touch the ball as it goes through. Oh, this is working well so far. So initially when there were like a, a bunch of us, it was really hard because it had to go through every single one of us. We started with 12 people on the production line. They were very crowded together and they had 30 seconds to do it. So we counted how many balls there were and then we kept getting rid of a worker, getting rid of a worker. I'm sorry, but I'm going to get rid of you. Then we had just one guy running like a maniac from one end of the classroom to the other. You're working with the concepts hands-on, you know, you, you got a, a much better perspective on how these concepts work and how they're applied. It's far more informative and you actually learn something through doing. Doing it yourself, like being the person that's just not just absorbing the information but working with it, that helps a lot in learning it. They saw the concept come alive and that's what I was trying to do, is make the concept, a very, very easy concept, come alive and I know that if I do that, they're going to remember it. Ten years from now, I'm definitely sure I'm going to remember the activities over the lecture. I was involved in it, I saw how it worked, and I was able to kind of better understand the concepts because of it. Nine.